He's a kind of an exceptional horse. We were lucky enough to train him. His dam, Altesse de Rocco, was the best three all in France and gave her son a main asset, speed. Bred by Yumka and Tabarak, started in training in Qatar as a two-year-old and get the first of his 13 wins on his first outing. He showed such promise that he was taken with other top Yumkan horses to Europe in 2011 and won the Qatar Coupe d'Europe on his first Group 1 race. Tabarak had not only speed, he proved to have stamina when he won the Emir Sword in Qatar over 2,400 meters. His strength was his incredible turn of foot. As Olivier Pellier said, he was a race car. You could wait a while and then press the speed button in the last 200 meters. Tabarak preferred good ground despite having won on heavy ground. Tabarak won six group races in a row at Doha during season 2012-2013, finishing his winter by a triumph in the famous Emir Sword on 2,400 meters before taking his fourth group one at Doncaster in UK in September, also coming back on the mile. Very strongly for Lerier Pellier, Tabarak on the far side, and struck the front as they race up towards the line, and the highest racing team in Arabian in the world lands his fourth group one. We were worried in Doncaster as the ground was heavy. He raced in the back of the field, but thanks to Olivier Pellier, he showed his great turn of foot and passed everyone in the last 200 meters. He's not a big type of horse, but has a good physique. He was precocious, thanks to his sire Nizam, who also made his debut at three. Tabarak raced early in the season and won first time out in Doha. He's a precocious horse, who raced over short or long distances. Tabarak is by proven Yumkan sire Nizam, Tabarak's dam, Altes de Rocco by Manganat, has produced six winners from six falls of racing edge by four different stallions, three of which, Alanka, Altair and Tabarak, have won Group 1 races. Tabarak is standing for 2015 at Arras du Grand Courjon, Le Lyon Angers, West France.